always, when I teach a class in a new place, I get to hear people's awesome stories of health and healing through changing the diet to eat in ways that are more wise and responsible. And tonight I met Lisa, and Lisa is online as Lupus Girl Goes Raw. Goes raw. Yes. So what happened to your health? You were diagnosed how long ago? I was diagnosed in 2007 with lupus, although I had symptoms forever and nobody could diagnose me. So only four years ago, lupus is um, one of the scarier autoimmune one diseases. diseases. Yeah, I mean, you, you're literally crippled. You get rheumatoid arthritis, you get memory loss, you get digestive issues, you get anything you could, you have. And I think that's why it's so hard for them to diagnose it, because you have so many symptoms. Mm -hmm. And when I was finally diagnosed, I decided not to take the conventional route. And you know, I was one of those persons who said, you know, what's the side effect of that drug? Yeah, yeah I want to keep my kidneys. Yeah. So I started searching, and it took me a while. I was literally kind of crippled in bed one day when I finally said, you know, God, I need an answer. Yeah, I'm either going home or they got to fix me. <laughs> yeah. And so I found an answer, and I heard of raw foods, and I started searching, and your blog was one of the first ones I found. It's been a long time. Wow. Haven't talked about my story in a long time. And I just kept going forward. I live near Hippocrates Institute, and I found them, and I called. I could not afford their program, but I could afford to take some classes. And I learned about living foods and the difference. And in three days, I no longer had joint pain. In two weeks, the doctor told me my white blood cell, white blood cell count was back up to normal, so I no longer had lupus because yeah, that's how they right. determine it. And within three months, I had lost 40 pounds, which was literally the inflammation that I was holding. And I looked like a new person, acted like a new person, it was totally a new person. And that's why I started my blog, was to share it with people. And luckily, you know, there's a lot of information out there. You're you symptom free, free now. now. Yes, have been Kay. for two years. I hear these stories all the time. I wish y'all could hear all the amazing stories that I do. Brian Clement, Hippocrates Institute. He's a genius. What Hippocrates does is very, very healing. I hope to go there myself soon. Um, very excited to hear Lisa's story. I, I get to hear about miracles every day. But you know what? It's very simple stuff. When we feed our bodies the appropriate fuel, we can expect our own immune system to heal us as, as it, it's, it's there for us to do. But when our immune system is down, we 